Hello everyone, kumusta? This is Che and welcome to my channel. Mabuhay from Philippines. These are my new mini phalaenopsis and according to the seller, these are all matured and blooming size. But they are not spiking yet and I bought them for only 130 pesos per piece. Barato kaayo. I bought them from Ms. Jel Velasco and you can find her at Pinoy Phalaenopsis Lovers Facebook group. I will include the link of that group in the description. Now let me show you these mini files one by one. I will repot them and I will plant them all in semi-hydro setup using plastic cups and hydroton as medium. I will just remove them all from their soft plastic pots and I will also remove the moss from the roots and clean the roots. I think this is enough and I will just do the same to my other mini falls and then after I clean all of their roots, I will spray their roots with hydrogen peroxide. This is one of my mini falls and I have already sprayed their roots with hydrogen peroxide and I also washed them with water. They all look healthy and they all have healthy roots. And now I changed my mind. I will no longer plant them in semi-hydro setup. This was my first plan to plant them in plastic cups but i changed my mind so i will no longer use this cup and i will plant my mini phalaenopsis in my tulumia setup i will be using this and if you haven't watched my tulumia repotting video i will include the link in the description i will be using three inch square plastic pots and i also used nylon wires because i'm going to hang them in our fence I will still use Hydroton as my medium and I will place a thin layer of sphagnum moss on top. This is done and I will do the same to my other mini phalaenopsis and I will show you their final setup or final look after I finished with all of them. 
They are all done and here they are in our fence. I like the way they look but I am just not sure how long these 3 inch square plastic pots can accommodate them. I hope that they will stay minis. I hope that they will not grow large because if that happens, I'm going to repot them in larger pots. So here are my tolumnias and my mini dendrobiums in the same setup. If you haven't watched my garden tour video, I will include the link in the description so that you will see my collections and so that you will see my space and understand me why I planted these orchids in our fence because I am maximizing our space. Here are my mini phalaenopsis now after two months. I planted them here last March 22 and today is May 23 and I will show you their growths and progress. After two months, I must say that they have grown a lot and I like their setup. Some of them had lost their lower leaves but that's normal and this one is growing its new leaf, second new leaf. This one is growing a new leaf and a root that is growing outside the pot. This one also had grown a new leaf and that root is growing downwards. I hope that they will just grow inside the pot. This one had lost lower leaves but she is now growing a new leaf and growing new roots. And here, this one had already grown new leaves. I think the smallest one is her second new leaf in this setup. And this one with nice leaves had already grown that small leaf before and is now growing a new leaf. But look at that leaf. It is bigger than the older leaves and I hope that this will be the biggest leaf that she will have. This one had also grown a new leaf and this one here had grown new leaves. I want them to stay minis because of the pots that I have. I only have small 3 inch square plastic pots and I don't want to buy larger pots but if they will outgrow their pots, I have no choice but to buy new larger pots. I like this setup because it's easier for me. It has easier maintenance compared with my orchids in semi-hydro or self-watering pots. But I water them every other day, I also flush them every month, and I fertilize them with the same fertilizer that I used with my other outdoor orchids. Thank you for being with me and I apologize if I haven't replied to all of your comments yet. I've been busy. Thank you for watching. Maraming salamat. Paalam. See you on my next videos.